Here at Umami, we have the ability to display additional related photos and videos at the bottom of our articles on our site. We use Drupal 8's media library, which makes it really easy to create and reuse multiple kinds of media. As an Umami editor, I was tasked with adding some mushroom photos to the end of an article about mushrooms. This is where the media library comes in handy. I can edit the article, scroll to the bottom, and click the Add Media button. The media library opens, and I can see media used elsewhere on the site. One of the existing images is of a mushroom, so I go ahead and select that. I want more than one photo, though, so I'll upload a few more. I can upload as many files at once as I need to, so I choose three images of mushrooms. Once they're done uploading, I notice that one of them isn't a mushroom. That's okay, though, because it's easy to remove that item before saving. Once I enter any required fields, metadata in this case, I can save and immediately insert the new media into the field, but I choose save and select because I want to add more media. This field allows images and remote video, so I see a tab for each of these media types. I switch to the remote video tab and paste a URL for a video hosted on Vimeo. I now see both my images and video in the widget where I can rearrange them to my liking. Once happy, I save the article and scroll down to see my additional media displayed as I would expect.